that's a puppy barking. Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. So in today's vlog, we're going to be talking about Gunner, our brand new Australian cattle dog, Blue Healer Puppy. Gunner's about eight weeks old now. We've had him for 11 days, so a little over two weeks. And uh, we're gonna talk about uh, his weight, how much weight he's gained. We're gonna talk about his biting, and we're gonna talk about some modifications we're gonna make in the house, because obviously when you're bringing your puppy home, there's some things you need to do. And what else we're gonna talk about? What else did I say? I think that about covers it. So biting, his biting, uh, modifications to the house, his weight, and just general puppy stuff. So stay tuned. We're gonna get Gunner's weight and this is how we do it. I'm gonna weigh myself first. I'm not gonna show you how much I weigh, but then we're gonna get Gunner, I'm gonna hold him and we'll figure out how much he weighs by doing that. So let's see how much I weigh. Come here, Gunner. Woo. Let me get you. Come here. All right, now we got Gunner. Okay, come here, boy. Come be a good boy. Let's see how much he weighs. Let's see. Oh, okay, I've gotta wait till my scale finishes. No, no, I need Now he won't be still on the on the scale. Look at it. Oh my gosh, what is he freaking out for? He, he won't stay still. Please stay still, dog. Shh. Okay, I got it. Alright, so when we got Gunner, he was five and a half pounds, five point five. And he weighs how much now? 8.2. He weighs 8.2 pounds, so that's pretty good. And two weeks, well, yeah, about two weeks, he's gained three pounds. Yeah, a little three pounds. So you have it. So I think that's about right for a, a puppy where he eats pretty much everything we give him. So um, he'll, he'll eat so much, his belly will just get full. And of course, then he's gonna immediately go poop. So, but yeah. 8.2 pounds? Yep, 8.2. 8.2 pounds, okay, cool. Gunner, you're growing, boy. It, it's so hard to tell if he's, um, because we're with him every day, it's so hard to tell how big he's getting. Um, but uh, yeah, he's growing. There he is. Hey, Gunner. Hey, buddy. Look at the camera. Where are you going? Here, Gunner. So you're growing, boy. You're going. <clears throat> okay, so let's sit down and talk about his biting. <laughs> so well, luckily we have Roscoe. We got Roscoe here. And uh, Roscoe I think helps with the situation, but it doesn't make it any easier. Uh, nope. And, uh, but his, his biting is, his biting's pretty rough. So, I watch a bunch of other YouTube videos, you know, with dog trainers and everything. And, um, no, not yet. I'm really trying to figure out some techniques for, you know, preventing biting. And, uh, so we, we, we try the redirection with toys and that works for you know probably five minutes and he'll play with the toys and okay where were we <laughs> you know let me hold the dog let's see if this works while i'm while i'm recording come here boy come here let's hold your big eight pound dog eight pound puppy so yeah, his biting is is pretty bad, as you, and all he wants to do is bite, 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 bite. Like as you can tell right now, he just he's going he's going to bite flesh, whatever gets within you know five feet of his of his mouth, he's going to bite. So there's a couple things I've done. Um, we try to redirect with toys, and uh, do I have a toy? So let's see if I can if I can get a toy here. So if I get a toy. And uh, he'll he'll start he'll start playing with a toy, and and this will last probably you know five minutes I don't know um, it'll last a few minutes, and he'll play with the toy. So this is this is one technique you know we're trying, and uh, 
The other technique is we got some of these uh, we got some of these bully sticks right here, cadet bully sticks, and um, these are actually uh, I found out after the fact that that he he wants one right now. He he's got one right here somewhere. I need to find it, but they're, they're actually um, bull. Uh, yeah, bull, bull penis. <laughs> so, um, but um, they call it, what do they call it? They call it bull pizzle. So that, that, that's those and they, they stink to high, to high heaven. Um, they're just, the smell is awful, but these dogs love it. Roscoe, Roscoe loves them too. And Gunner will, will tear them up too. And I need to find the one he was working on because these things aren't cheap. They're like this bag right here was $24 for 6.5 ounce. So, and he wants one right now. He can smell them because they stink. But so that's, that's the biting situation. We're trying to redirect, trying to do other things. Um, I'm even putting on some welding gloves and I'm, I'm playing with them that way. Um, he, he, he kind of knows that he can really, really well down on the gloves when I got the gloves on. Ow. There you go. See, he just, he still, he goes, even if you got a toy, he'll go straight for the flesh. But, yeah, he's a healer. That's what they do. I mean, I can say no. 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 And then he'll go after my strings on my hoodie. I mean, it's whatever's there, he will, he'll go after it. So, it's a work in progress. Um, he's very much a puppy, and he's going to be a puppy for a long time. And, and we know it. We we going to love you. Yep. Shit, we love you. So I don't know if you guys know this or not, but we actually rescued a a, a red healer, our previous healer, from the uh, the local pound. And uh, no, I want that back. And we don't really know what, what, what happened to his puppy life, if you will. I mean, he was probably six months old when we got him. No. And um, that dog, I'm telling you, he, at six months, that dog really, I mean, it was, he was a great, he was a great dog. I mean, he was one of the best experiences we've ever had with a, with a dog. And not to mention the fact that he was a, he was a red healer. He was, you know, a full-blooded Australian cattle dog. If you go back through my videos, like, there's some videos with, Coco in those videos, but um, I think that kind of ruined us with with healers. Um, they're they're highly intelligent. I mean, you can. I mean, they are bred to to herd cattle, and you know they do that very well. And uh, but um, they're very very smart dogs. So, and I've already seen with Gunner how smart he is at at such a young age. And right now, his I think his uh, his mouth gets the better of him. <laughs> because he's just a little baby but uh, it's one of those things you have to work through and there's really nothing you can do about it but just deal with it you have to you gotta foul, find ways to ah, no no hey gonna no and he'll pay attention he knows what no means and like he will he will stop for a minute but then his attention span is so short he, he goes right back to it see no no let me get my toy come here I say, give your toy. Back to a toy. All right, there's toy. Let me go find his other uh, bully stick he was working on, and I'll be right back. And I'll show you how he, how he tears that up. This thing. All right, so here's the bully stick. He's about tore that one up right there. You want it? Come here. Let's get you up on my lap. So he loves these, he loves these, uh, bull, you know what, and, uh, he will, he'll pretty much tear that thing up. It, the, the other problem we have with Gunner is he's, he's more interested in, in wanting to know what our German Shepherd Roscoe is doing. So, um... They play pretty well. Roscoe is is having to put Gunner in his place, so to speak, and Roscoe will will show will show him his teeth and his mouth, you know, over his entire 
head because Roscoe's mouth is big enough just to pretty much swallow Gunner's whole entire head. And uh, I'm watching him real closely, but I don't I don't think Roscoe would ever do anything to harm Gunner. Um, I mean, yeah, I think he knows he's a baby. And uh, you know that, that German shepherds are they know that kind of stuff and I mean they play they play rough and you know of course Gunner thinks that he's a you know probably a, a, a cow you know a cow already and he wants to herd him so two herders basically hurting each other uh, which is what they do but anyway um, yeah he loves this thing he's already about toward the end of it up and these things are they get soft and they can die they can digest them and um, all the videos videos I've seen on these uh, bully sticks are pretty positive. I mean, there's not really too many negative things about it. Their stomachs can de can process these things, you know, once they swallow the, the soft part or whatever. But, yeah, it's really pure protein. <laughs> all right. Uh-oh, I get it. You dropped it. They stink. There you go. Come back. There you go. Get back. You want to fall off? You want to fall off? <laughs> Are your paws dirty or is that just the color of your paws? No, I guess that's the color of your paws. They look dirty. No, they're not dirty. So yeah, um, what else? So uh, basically, you know, I try to preoccupy him with chewing on something like the bully stick, and you know, I'm petting him really good, and I'm touching his paws. I touch his paws a lot because when I start to do, you know, I'm going to do his nails. So look, he's chewing me and this thing at the same time. We get that, not me. But I want to make sure he, you know, I can touch his paws when I get ready to do his nails. He won't be freaked out by that. But uh, get his hind paws. And uh, see, so he's trying to. He, he, ow! Hey, no! See, he knows what no is, so that's good. But um, he's still a puppy. He's a baby. He's a good boy. He's a good baby. Yep. All right. What are you doing, boy? Huh? Yeah. His coat is so pretty. He got a pretty coat. And he's still so soft. You're so soft. But when they get older, they'll start getting the undercoat. And uh, they won't be as soft, but that that's just the part of being having a blue healer. But he's so soft still right now. It's amazing. He's a self little puppy. Yes, he is. He's just a soft puppy. Yeah, yeah, don't fall off my lap. You'll fall. But he, he's already fell off some stuff. So, <laughs> he's not been hurt. I mean, these dogs are... Oh, nope, here, redirect. Here, get that. There's Gunner. Hey guys. So that about wraps up today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please uh, please subscribe and uh, please like and hit the notification on YouTube there so you can see when I upload new videos about raising Gunner here. I tried to keep these videos um, around 10 minutes. I don't know if this one made it. So um, I know I wanted to talk about some things we did in the house to uh, keep a puppy and raise a puppy like this. But there's some things you need to do when you got a puppy like this. So the make life a little easier for you and your puppy um, but i'll go into that on the next video so stay tuned looks like i finally wore this dog out today he's yawning that's a good thing right all right say bye bye gunner bye bye